blue blood, glorious riches, and a life in the spotlight. Prince Harry and Prince George have got a lot in common, including the love of a very British sport. In the wake of the feud at the heart of the royal family, Prince William is reportedly resigned to the fact that he has lost his brother. These are tricky times to say the least, and it's certainly fair to say that the royals have been living through historic days lately. Between Netflix's Harry and Meghan docuseries, the many startling revelations from Harry's memoir, the ongoing scandal surrounding Prince Andrew, and the fact that the new king is just a few months away from his coronation, there's much ado about the House of Windsor these days. Many believe that a reconciliation between Prince Harry and the rest of the senior royals is essential to the monarchy, while others think that too much damage has been done to mend that bridge. Either way, with the coronation looming, it's easy to wonder what will come of all that bad blood. Ultimately, a reconciliation would be positive for the family, not just for optics and the mental well-being of the senior royals, but also for the children. After all, no one knows better than William and Harry how unique and isolating the challenges of growing up in the spotlight can be. That's not all, though. It turns out that better relations might allow Prince Harry to give Prince George a few pointers on their favourite game. Prince William and Kate Middleton tend to keep quiet on topics regarding their children. On February 25th, however, the Prince and Princess of Wales attended a Wales versus England Six Nations rugby match in Cardiff, and Kate shared a little about just how important rugby has become to their family. According to Kate, their nine-year-old son, Prince George, is graduating from tag rugby and moving on to touch rugby. Kate added that George, being tall, certainly has the physique for the sport. It's easy to draw a comparison between George and his uncle, who also excelled at rugby in his time. Prince Harry was a successful rugby player while at Eton College and has maintained a love for the sport since. In his memoir, Spare, he shared, I played all sport, though rugby captured my heart. Beautiful game, plus a good excuse to run into stuff very hard. While Prince George is clearly the MVP of the royal family right now, he's not the only one following in Harry's footsteps. Kate Middleton shared that their youngest child is also a fan of the sport, saying, Prince Louis is mad about rugby. They all love sport. They are at an age where they just love running around. Princes George and Louis and their sister, Princess Charlotte, also play football, gymnastics and tennis. In fact, Prince George even had tennis lessons with star tennis player Roger Federer. As for the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's kids, their dad is apparently eager to get them involved in rugby too. In a video chat for the Rugby Football League's 125th birthday back in 2020, Prince Harry shared how excited he was to one day teach his then 15-month-old son, Archie, all about the sport. Well, I've got a little bit of space outside, which, I'm, which we're uh, fortunate enough to have. So I need to get him playing, playing some rugby league. It seems likely that Archie has gotten his hand on a pint-sized rugby ball by now. So, no matter what happens with the royal family drama between now and Charles's coronation, he is hoping that there are some royal rugby matches in the family's future. <laughs> <laughs>